Hi, I'm going to teach you how to do cosecant, secant, and cotangent on the Casio FX300ES. First, you want to make sure that your calculator is in radians, and you do that by first checking if there's an R right there. Then you know it's in radians. If not, if it says a D, then you want to click Shift, Mode, and 4 for radians. And then if you want to go back to degrees, you just do shift mode and go back to degrees. So if you let if you want to do cosecant, first you want to click sine, then the angle. So let's say you want to do pi over 4. Click enter. And then you want to click this x to the negative first. Enter and that is cosecant of pi over 4. Same goes for secant and cotangent. If you want to do secant of pi over 4, first you want to do cosine pi over 4, enter, and the negative, ex negative 1 exponent, and enter. And same for cotangent. This time, let's say you want to know what cotangent of 5 pi over 6 is. I don't know. You want to do tangent 5 5 pi over 6. Click enter. And then you want to click you want to click enter. And cotangent of 5 pi over 6, I think that's what we did, yeah, is negative square root of 3.